Hey guys, welcome back. So today I have like my second portion of my PR mail or what's in my mailbox haul video. So I received this really big generous package from e.l.f. and I wanted to do like a whole separate video on this one because there's so many products in here. I didn't want the video to be really, really long if I included all these things with all the other stuff that I received. So if you want to see what I got in this box, just keep watching. So these are brush cleansing wipes from e.l.f. So when I'm doing my makeup, sometimes I do like to use a wipe to clean my brush off. So these are like individually packed and I'll have to see how they work. I will definitely include these like in a loves and letdowns video, which I am behind on filming. So, so I got a couple of their new brushes. I love e.l.f. brushes, especially the studio line. They're some of my favorites and I use them all the time. So this first one is called the Flawless face brush. The only thing is they did not write that anywhere on the brush, so that would have been nice, but it's very tapered right here at the ferrule, and it just looks very interesting, so I'm really excited to try this one out. This one is the Sculpting Face Brush. It has a very interesting shape to it, so this would be a good brush for cream contouring. So they sent me this palette. This is the Need It Nude eyeshadow palette, and I really wanted their the matte one because I heard that the matte palette was really good but I didn't even see it on their website. I don't know why. Maybe I was oblivious or maybe they were out of stock or something but I didn't see it on there. I'm telling you I almost dropped something in every single video. I have very slippery fingers. So this is what the packaging looks like. And that's what the eyeshadows look like. Let's watch them. Ooh, the matte one feels really soft. The mattes, they all feel really soft actually. So, so they sent this Artistry eyeshadow palette. It has 20 eyeshadows in here. And it comes in a little pouch, which is really cute. It kind of reminds me of the Urban Decay packaging on their Vice palettes. It's very similar package, packaging to that. So it has a nice size mirror, just a really nice looking palette. Nice bright colors, but some neutrals as well. So I think this is limited edition. If you guys want a video using this or reviewing it, let me know. And it comes with a double-ended brush as well like a flat shader brush and then a little bit more of a fluffy shader brush. So then I got this cream blush palette in soft. Um, they have multiple cream palettes, but this one says soft on it. Ooh, it looks really pretty. The colors are really pretty. So next is the cream contour palette. Elf is stepping it up. Look at their packaging. It's so nice. Go Elf. This is the Elf Runway Ready Lip Palette. And it comes with a little lip brush. Hmm. Can't wait to play with that one. So I was most excited about their Beautifully Bare collection that they just came out with. So this is a new palette in the Beautifully Bare collection called Total Face Palette Soft and Subtle. And look at the packaging. It's very mirror-like, reflective, very nice packaging. Go Elf. Looks so pretty, guys. Oh, I can't wait to use this. This looks really, really nice. This is the Beautifully Bare Lip Brush. Okay, so this is what it looks like. And then if you put this inside the cap and push it down, the lip brush pops out. So, hmm, that's very interesting. Very nice packaging. So these are the Beautifully Bare Satin Lipsticks. I have four shades. The packaging looks like nice acrylic packaging. Very sturdy feeling. Mm, the lipsticks smell like a MAC lipstick. This one's called Touch of Berry. This one is Touch of Pink. 
This one is Touch of Blush. And this one is called Touch of Nude. So they sent the Flawless Matte Eyeshadow Neutral Matte Palette. It's just one of those smaller palettes they carry. And then they sent a couple of their lock on liner and brow gel. One's in light brown and the other one's in taupe blonde. I'm really excited to try these. So it's like a brow pomade. And then they sent me some of their new skincare products. So they have the hydrating bubble mask. I love this packaging that they have. They have no parabens, sulfates, or phthalates. Just recently started using the other skincare products they had sent me a while back and so I will do a full separate review once I start using these but this is very nice packaging elf. Hydrating gel melt cleanser. Looking forward to that. This is the daily hydration moisturizer which I've already started using. So this is a facial massager. So this is the pore refining brush and mask tool. So this side's like rubbery and then this side has like a little brush that's flat top in shape. And then this is the cleansing duo face brush. Huh. These bristles are really, really soft guys. And it has this rubbery side that's like, looks like it would be good for like exfoliating your skin. All right guys, so that concludes this e.l.f. haul video. If you guys want individual reviews on any of the products, just let me know. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching as always. And I just wanna say thank you to e.l.f. for sending this package. It was very generous of you. So thank you guys, I love you and have an amazing day.